So hi everyone, Blender MCP has been trending on internet for quite some time, where now Claude can connect to Blender software to generate 3D graphics for you and can design things for you. Yes, you heard it right, can do the engineering part for you. For that, you need to integrate Blender MCP in your Claude desktop app that I've already explained in my previous video how to do it. In this particular use case, I would be showing you a use case how Claude can be a great tool for working on Blender to design a room for us. So let's get started. Let me provide a basic prompt and then see how it goes. Design a bedroom with a double bed sofa present in it. So I've given it a prompt. If you have enabled Blender MCP, you should be able to see a hammer sign like this. It is present for me. So I will just hit it. And by the time I will also open up Blender software to show you live updates on what happens. Let's see the magic. I think when you're running for the first time, you need to allow for this particular case, all the different tools that it will be using. As you can see, the object has been removed now. This uh, There was a cube present. Now you can see walls are coming out as Claude is moving. Claude is now designing the room for you. And this is something very interesting. As you can see, we can see the live updates on the Blender application, how Claude is working on it and designing your bedroom. Add a table lamp also, it is also adding stuff on its own. So this is very, very crucial. And in the end, we will see what it develops for us. It is adding different, different things. Lamp shade, adding a small wardrobe also. Very cool, to be honest, very interesting. And now I think designers need to think of another job because this is just working fine. If it can give you even 90% of the uh, design, I think you should be good to go. Adding a window, adding walls, small rug. It is adding different things. Very interesting. There are certain permissions that is asking for continuously for a given chat. So you need to be a little alert for now. I think I will figure out a way how to provide access every time. It is adding walls now as you can see wall right, wall left, sofa material, choosing out the material for sofa, sofa mattress. This is very interesting I would say. And this MC, uh, that is what I was thinking why Blender MCP is trending so much and now I can see the results from my eyes only. It is designing the entire thing for you. For now it is setting up the material for the different stuff. As you can see, hence you are not seeing any updates going here on here. But soon you would be seeing some updates coming in. I haven't used Blender ever, so don't feel that I know how Blender works. It is for me also for the very first time. So this is very, very exciting for me as well uh, to see uh, AI taking over a software and working on your behalf. To be honest, this is very, very interesting. Now, as you can see, I have designed a cozy bedroom with double bed. A solid base, comfortable blue mattress, armrest on both sides, a backrest that supports sitting, sleeping, etc. Complimentary furniture has also been added. As you can read, a wooden wardrobe for storage, room details, a double bed sofa works both as seating and multiple things. I think it's very interesting. Let's see the final thing that Claude has generated for us from different angles. A sofa is there. I can see a lamp also coming at the back. Laptop is there as you can see, wardrobe is there, here is a lamp present, very interesting, very interesting. So with this, we will wrap this up, this looks beautiful and I think within 3-4 to four minutes we are able to get a design. I think if we prompt it better, it can do a lot of more things, but for now I think given a given decent enough prompt and without no detailing, I think it is able to add a lot of stuff here, so very well done. So I hope you'll try, you liked it and you try out Blender MCP, thank you so much.